Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is Photopea. I want to show you how to add images and edit some of those images. I'll start with this simple one. It loads up nicely. Thank you very much. File open. We'll add a second one. Try that one. And now to get this image over here or that image over there, you need to <clears throat> duplicate into, right click, duplicate into, choose your layer, in this case WDF. We go over and you see, hmm, well, where is it? Well, it's on top. Okay, so uh, let's m give a little more demonstration of what we can do here. Uh, I'm going to increase the size of the eraser. And now I'm going to erase just the top part of this and expose the leaf. Okay, not very exciting, but it does work. And here's my leaf. Just if you were, weren't convinced, there's my leaf. Turn it back on. My leaf is still there. And it's pretty powerful. This is a JPEG file. Now I can file save as and save it as a PSD, which is rocking and rolling. I'm going to save it as a web file. And PNG is fine. I don't care that much. This is just a demo. Give it a new name. <clears throat> and there it is. Saved as a PNG. Now let's file open. New name open and there it is so uh that's photopia photopia.com and the developer has been very 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 responsive to requests for information and help so i would recommend it if you're looking for a a tool for modifying uh, psd files in fact let's let's go one more step and see how many layers we have we have a top bar, we have a shadow, there's the shadow, there's the top bar, and background. Um, I'm not seeing, oh, maybe it's under text. Nope. Gradient stroke, etc. Here's our text description, there it is. Now, can we edit the description here? Let's try that <clears throat> since we're here. Yes, we can. That's pretty cool. So, again, that's photopia.com. Thanks for watching and happy computing.